Well, earlier I spoke to Channel 7's US correspondent Tim Lester outside that Virginia courthouse and I began by asking him what it was like when that verdict was delivered. Well, Rebecca, there was a lot of Hollywood about it, as there has been about the whole six weeks of this trial. A large crowd at that time was gathered outside the court behind me, and every time the jury said yes to the uh, defamation charges that Johnny Depp had levelled against his ex-wife, Amber Heard, there was a loud roar of approval. Essentially, they got the three yeses they need to the three elements of the defamation that Johnny Depp ran, and a, a, a damage damages claim that would amount to about roughly 23 million uh, US uh, or New Zealand dollars, 15 million US dollars uh, Amber Heard is now in debt to Johnny Depp for. Amber Heard of course on her part winning part of her defamation but a far smaller claim around 2 million uh, US dollars awarded in damages to her and both parties frankly uh, finished knowing that Johnny Depp had had a clear win here today. And Tim, what does this verdict mean for Johnny Depp and for Amber Heard? It has been an at times horrific and confronting case. No one really wins here, do they? Well, perhaps not, Rebecca, though Johnny Depp's image has pr uh, proved m remarkably elusive through this. He's been wildly supported by millions online, certainly winning the social media debate throughout this trial. And he's had hundreds at times, more than a thousand supporters around this courtroom cheering him. So there's a big question for Johnny Depp. Has it rehabilitated his image enough for the major movie producers back in Hollywood to give him a go again? Because there's no doubt for a couple of years he's been in exile. For Amber Heard, obviously more damaging. And Amber Heard in her own statement has said that this is a setback for women, alluding to the Me Too argument around this, that in fact Amber Heard, if she didn't win this case, uh, this would uh, mean other women who faced violence and wanted to make claims publicly might be dissuaded from doing so. So two completely different and uh, 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 um, important arguments, certainly from Amber Heard in that regard. Um, and the Johnny Depp one, his career, well, it's a question, I think, in the months ahead of watching this space, Re yeah, Rebecca. It's highly complex, Tim. Thank you.